What's up, everybody? Welcome to today's episode of the Comeback Podcast with your host, Mark Jennison, founder and creator of the Comeback Movement, the man that is going to change your life. Today's topic is just make a fucking decision. Sit back, enjoy the show, and let's roll. So I'm actually filming two of these things, or I should say recording two of these things today. My first one was inspired by my dog. My second one was inspired by these group of veterinarians that meet every single Tuesday, every morning at the same coffee shop that I go to. They sit in a different room than me. They, but I can hear them. I can hear them talking. I can hear them talking about the same fucking problems in their life day in and day out that they do nothing about. They show up, they bitch to each other about it. They're talking about their work. They're talking about finances. They're talking about Betty Lou from fucking... (laughs) from account receivables, not doing her job. They're talking about this horse that fell, whatever is going on inside of their life. But what I found is this, inside of the turmoil, inside of their world, inside of what they've done and the choices they created, the habits that they've successfully built for themselves, what they've done was they've been able to create a bitch fest, a pity party, their own mastermind where they come together and they solve absolutely nothing. And the reason that they can solve absolutely nothing is because they can't make a fucking choice. And today, the reason, I'm, the reason that I'm actually talking about this is I was walking out. I heard one of the guys say exactly what I just said. We've talked and we've talked and we've talked, but we make no decisions. What are we going to do? And my thought was like, oh, cool. Good for that guy standing up. Kind of fucking wanting to do something about it instead of just fucking bitching. Now, I don't know because I walked out what the decision made or if they're even going to make one or if next Tuesday I'm going to go back in there and they're going to be doing the same shit. They probably are. But I know this, everything in of our life, every single thing comes down to a choice or decision. And you can sit, you can waver in whatever decision you want. You can sit and you can listen to this podcast. You can read books. You can show up on videos. You can go to AA meetings. You can join my program. You can do whatever the fuck you want. But if you don't make a choice to go all in and decide to actually do the work and fix yourself and actually inherit these fucking belief systems from whoever you decide to go on, you will do nothing. You will sit in a pity party. You will sit in a bitch fest and you will fucking be stagnant. Your wife will leave you. Your kids will hate you. Your life will not reach its potential. Your business will crumble and you will be stuck sitting at a coffee shop, in your case, probably a bar or alone with a bottle of liquor doing nothing because you couldn't get yourself to the spot where you can believe in your own mind that you can make this decision. The decision isn't to join me. The decision isn't, isn't to go to AA. The decision isn't to fucking just go out and go for a run or whatever it is you need to do. The decision is this. Do I want to be better? Do I truly want to get this fixed? Do I truly want to put down the alcohol? Do I want to gain control or do I want to quit for good? We move across this path called the four C's of my program. Choice, clarity, confidence, control. Boom, simple, very fucking easy. There's tools that help you make those choices, but really when it comes down to the first choice, you don't need a tool. You need to reach down inside of your heart today, inside of your gut, inside of your pit, look in the mirror and say, this is what I want. This is where alcohol fits in or this is where it doesn't fit in. This is what I want my relationship. This is where what I don't want my relationship. This is how I want a parent. This is how I don't want a parent. This is how much money I want to make. This is what I'm, the work I'm afraid to do. And quit avoiding the tough fucking questions. Because if you can't make a decision today, you never will. The reason we don't do the things that we know we should, because you know what you should do, is because we don't want to. And we understand that you're making an action, like a, 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 an actual like conscious decision to do the things you don't want to do, you're already making a fucking choice. So when you're making that choice, and I woke up to some text message this morning, now I'm going a little bit deeper, I said, why do I keep doing this? Why do I keep doing this? Why do I keep doing this? Well, my question that I asked them is this, what have you done to work on it? Have you done any of the work? Have you listened? Have you done, have you done anything? And the answer that came back was 100% honest, no. And the reason they didn't do the work is because it's hard and they didn't want to, but they couldn't make the choice of what the fuck they want. This is not rocket science. I am not brilliant. I am not fucking smart. I'm decisive. I figured out, I figured out ways to create new habits. I figured out ways to be able to take my communication, take my skills, take my energy and fucking help men who can't make choices, get control of their lives, become the men that they want to be. But it's not for everybody. It's for action takers. It's for people who want to do the work. It's for people who can see a better fucking future for their family, for their business, 
for their wives, for themselves, for the legacy. And that's a very, very important piece. Now, even if I do work with you or I don't work with you, you can still make a choice. You have a mind, you have thoughts, just make the fucking choice. I don't want to, I don't want you to be the veterinarian sitting here for weeks and weeks and weeks, months. I've probably been sitting there before I started going there on Tuesdays, having the same fucking conversations. That is not a life. So my brother, if you're struggling to make a choice today, I want to help you. As always, all you have to do is type in IamAComeback.com forward slash apply. IamAComeback.com forward slash apply. And my team, myself, will reach out to you and we will leave you better than we found you. But it's going to take action. It's going to take commitment. It's going to take a choice to type that in and show up. That's it for today's episode of the Comeback Podcast. We will see you on tomorrow's episode. Have an amazing day. Take care.